shoot, baby. Packed in your stack, especially in the back, brother. I wanna thank your mother for a butt like that. Yo, the shot goes away. What's up guys, it's your boy Brandon. I just wanted to start out this video by telling you that it's gonna be kind of confusing and it's gonna throw you right in the gist. Unfortunately, I caught a fish when it was too dark to actually film. So usually I go out there about 3.30 and I kind of get the lay, I look around, you know, I'll throw my whopper plopper out and I'll get fish and they bounce off and this and that, but I never really catch anything. So even though I upgraded my equipment to the best GoPro and I'm filming from great angles and I'm filming in 4K, I can't spotlight the entire lake. So unfortunately, the only way I could get the footage was in the dark until I got the fish to the actual boat. But that's how my day started. So I can't start you with any kind of, you know, false. I'm not like the other YouTubers where, you know, I'll catch seven fish. And even though I changed clothes four times, I mean, which is obviously confusing to me on how they did that. But I'm going to give you the natural. If I get skunked, I get skunked. If I don't get skunked, I'm going to show you the footage. So I hope you appreciate the honesty, guys. And if you enjoy this video, please throw a like up there. And if, if you really want to see more content from me and you enjoy what I'm putting out there, understandably, I'm new to YouTube. I'm not a millionaire. Everything's coming out of my pocket. I have spent thousands to get where we are now. But if you enjoy it, please hit the subscribe button. It's totally free. If you look down in your bottom right, it's the red button. Turn it gray. And if you want to, hit the bell notification. So that way YouTube can send you notifications when I make a new video. Also, it's going to help soon because I'm going to start my giveaways. And when I do my giveaways, I am not sponsored by anyone. It comes out of my pocket. But I guarantee I'm not going to be making $5,000 a week through YouTube commercials and give you stick baits. You know, I'm going to do it right with you guys and show you my appreciation. So let's get back to the video. And remember, any day fishing is better than a day in the desert. Fish bump out. Should be the honey cast. Got him. Got him. Woo. There we go. First thing. Ugh. Oh, come on. Slow it down. You're a big one. Woo. You're a big one. Come on. Get in my net. Oh, first thing in the morning, baby. Woo. Holy shit. That's a big one, too. You guys get that topwater explosion? Good Lord and biscuits. Woo. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's a beaut right there, guys. That is a beaut. And thanks to our new rubber, uh, new rubber, uh, oh, yeah, that's a beauty. There you go, guys. Cat of bass in the house, boys. That's why you guys subscribe to the best Facebook or uh, YouTube channel and Facebook page there is. Because we don't mess around here. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pull that hook out. Look at that. He was barely hooked. Let me get a light on that. Yeah, that's a monster. Woo! He was barely hooked right there in the net. Okay, we're not going to pull him out of the net yet, guys. We're going to go ahead and weigh this beautiful bass. So let's go ahead and drop him down in the net. Let him flick around and have some fun. We're going to get our, uh, our setup undone. Let's hope he doesn't jump and break my neck. There we go, boys. That's what we come here for. Check out the... Woo! He's going to try to hop around on me a little bit. Come on, let's lip him up. Oh, look at the color on this bad boy. Whoa! Ah, oh, look at that. He is just beating me up. All right, guys, we're looking about what? What do you think, about three pounds? What do you think? Three pounds, guys? Woo! Let's get a scale on this bad boy. Holy shit. It's early. That's what I'm talking about. Excuse the language, guys. Excuse the language. Don't feel like getting monetized. Look at that beautiful fish, guys. Look at him. That's what I'm talking about. He hit me right. That's what I was talking about, guys. You got to finish your cast. 
That beautiful bass hit me right on the... There we go. That beautiful bass hit me right on the point. Like literally right on my bucket. All right. Ah, I hate when it does that. All right, let's zero out the scale. I'm really fed up with this Berkeley scale. All right, we're zeroed out. Let's let's get them lipped up. Yeah, Woo! Two pound. Oh, look at that! Three pounds on the mark, guys. Three pounder. You got that? You got that, boys? That's what I'm talking about. Three pounds on the mark. That's how we catch the fish here. All right, let's get our phone out. Let's get a beautiful picture. Oh, That's what I'm talking about. Three pounds first thing in the morning. Look at that beautiful. Beautiful bass. All right, we're gonna go ahead. Uh, take a couple beautiful bean put it footages. Get a couple great pictures. Uh, there we go. Look at the colors in that. I'm gonna throw them back in here real quick. Get my phone out, get me a good picture. We'll go back to slaying these bass. Look at that, I told you I was gonna bring you guys some amazing content. Amazing, amazing, amazing. Fuck, man. There we go. Yeah, we gotta turn this fucking. <sighs> Ew, doggy. Let me try to get a video. All right, boys. Woo! I just want to get this thing to sit on here for five seconds. There we go. Oh, man. Come on with this shit. Oh. Look at this. Beautiful fish. You guys see that? Look at the belly and look at the markings on this. Look at the mouth. This thing's huge. Three pounds, guys. Can't beat it? You join them. All right, let's go ahead. Put this baby back in the water. Woo, get out of here. That's what I'm talking about. All right, guys. There's your big footage you wanted. All right, let's keep going. Let's see if we can get anything else out of here. Hopefully, I got that topwater explosion on camera. I'm glad I uh, shuffle fucked around and got uh, out of here because, tell you one thing, 
we would have stayed out there on that point, we would have had a problem. All right, guys. We have now officially scared every freaking fish in the world. <laughs> so, there's your footage, guys. You ever have a question on if I catch fish? There you go. I ain't good, but I'm good. <laughs> All right. Remember what I was telling you guys? Oh, as I lose my paddle. All right. Remember some of the concerns I told you guys about, uh, about making sure that you, uh, Always retie and check your shit. We're going to go ahead and check. There we go. All right, let's keep rolling. Man, that thing literally caught that bad boy. Anches. Anches from the boat. He was just creeping. That's one of them. What is going on over there? First of all, it sounds like there's a ton. I hope nobody hit that elk. So every morning, like, must have missed him this morning. There's an elk. I think he eats at the park over here. I don't know why I'm hearing cattle. Dude, this cow sounds like it's right here on the river. I don't know if somebody hit that elk and it's crying. Really hope not. This fish usually hang out at this point right here. Oh, something just bit on that. I don't know what it was, but something just bit on that. I think it was really small, though. That was weird. Oh, got another one. Yeah. That's three, baby. Oh, come on. Oh, woo! Little one though. Why do I keep cat? That must have been the one I just caught. Calm down, little one. Calm down. There we go. Well, oh, he's gonna come off in about three seconds. He keeps hooking himself worse. Calm down, little one. Ah, oh, calm down. Look at that. He was. See this, guys? Look at that. He wasn't even hooked. <laughs> If I can't stop hooking him every three seconds. There you go, little buddy. Get back in there. You got heart. Honestly, I think somebody's cattle got out. I keep hearing people yell. That's crazy. So that's uh, three fish today, guys. So, when that happened, you know, sorry guys, a little emotional, <laughs> but when that happened, uh, I quit, and uh, that's when I noticed that the family company turned into what can you do for me company, not what I can do for you and your family, 
So that's when I made the decision to come home. And that's why, guys, I started this YouTube channel. That's why I was hoping people could subscribe and help me build this YouTube channel. Because I really want to be home with my family. And uh, so I'm going to keep shooting out content to you guys and showing, showing you guys anything you want in the comments. If you guys have ideas for challenges or fun things to do, I'm going to do them. And I'm going to keep showing you guys the best content on YouTube. And hopefully you guys subscribe and I can build a base where, you know, I can maybe gain a sponsorship or whatever. And then I can do giveaways for you guys. And you guys can return the favor by liking my videos and commenting. And then we go from there. Tell you, I'll tell you something, though, guys. We're going to have a giveaway coming up soon. So I don't know if it's going to be next video, this video, or what. We're going to have a giveaway. And I'm not sponsored, so anything that I give away, and it's not going to be the cheesy stuff a lot of these guys do. They're sponsored by giant companies, and they get, you know, you see their unboxing videos where they get $2,500 packages three thousand four thousand dollars and they send them rods and reels and all they give away in their drawing is a pack of Senkos. i'm not doing that crap i think that's that you know that's their choice i don't hate on anybody but i think you got to give back i mean when you're making a thousand bucks a week off of youtube which i'm not making anything guys and you're giving your 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 fans your supporters, you're giving them $20 worth of tackle or, you know, lures or whatever. I don't think that's fair because they're the reason why you are where you are. So that's my theory. If you guys choose to support this, then, you know, I appreciate it. But I'll tell you, let's get back to that big old fish I caught. If you guys are enjoying this footage, please do me a big favor. Hit the like button. I don't think any of my videos have got a like yet. <laughs> I don't blame you. I've had some terrible edited videos, but you know, YouTube ain't easy. None of this is easy. Fishing's the only easy part, but. Um. All right, guys, hopefully you enjoyed that video. Go ahead and throw a like up there and hit the subscribe button so that way I can keep throwing that content at you. Did you guys happen to see the size of the fish that I missed? Oh, my heart was beating. I was so pissed. This is right after I caught a really big one. That one would have been my personal best. It would have been my PB all day. I swear it was at least four and a half. At least. The piece of cheek it left on that, it tore itself off. The, I'm not even going to talk about it. I am so pissed about that. Either which way, guys. Thanks for watching the video. Stay tuned. I'll have another one for you tomorrow. And remember... What do I always say? Any day fishing is better than a day in the desert. Peace out, guys. Stay rad.